We'll have a good day today, Chelsea. In the post Unai Emery era, Meza Ozil seems to be a player that is now regularly involved, if not starting. For the second game now under Mikel Arteta, he starts again today. Are Arsenal a better side with him in it? Look, I think if you're talking about someone who can find that, the most difficult thing in football is to keep composed in the final third around the final pass and the final moment. He has that ability in abundance. We know he can compose himself, we know he's got that class. It's just the overall pack. I don't know, it's also a little bit of a makeshift at, at right back in a very interesting position. Well, you mentioned the performance at Tottenham and that back three were brilliant. They were quick into the tackle. And their worst run in that respect for 60 years. Nice well forward. Arsenal haven't let them settle in this first four minutes. That's the ones looking like. Because it likes to run towards the near post. And into an area that just, goodness me, what a headline that would have been if that had gone in. Torreira. Ozil. Arsenal been really good, the passing's been good. There's Ozil in the pocket, Torreira just finds him, pushes it through that Chelsea midfield. Chelsea not at it at all yet in this first part. So left the club. It's on by Chambers, and the header is in from Aubameyang. Chelsea melted away from him. And Arsenal, when you're on top, you need to score. And his first home goal as the manager. Well, not too much emotion from Mikel Arteta. So hard. A little bit about that about Chelsea as well, of course. Five defeats in the last seven. It's coming off, Gary, that Mesut Ozil has to play or be sold in January. I just think there's too much noise around certain players at your club. And the would say was uh, the fulcrum of the team, certainly under Maurizio Sarri, and to a large extent. I guess a word of caution for Arsenal supporters, it's only half an hour gone. Again. Uh, is on the pitch. Two or three yards short of getting to the ball, Chelsea. Close enough to get that challenge in that they want. Well, Frank Lampard. And they push so many players forward. Well, the break is on here. As they're not backing his own pace, but involving Nelson again. Nelson have been really doing the ball full stop. Really have. Quality of the possession, the passing, fantastic. Look at Ozil. I've often behind it anyway. Ozil. We were giving words a lie to the opinion, really, that the fact that the uh, embargo has now been lifted might not help the young players. They might be thinking who's coming in. They've played like they were going to keep their places. At... I think, you know, maybe you should come on into the game. You said that a few no. times about Jamie Carragher later. I think if you're Mikel Arteta, this is almost the game. And certainly at the end of this half. The problem, of course, when... There's it. That's him. That's him. Where'd he get? Okay. More natural right back. That's been a booking for most players today. Forward by Mustafa. Chelsea win it back. Okay, He's, good. Good. He's been good. I've seen less of him in the last 10 15 minutes as Chelsea have grown in the game, but for that first hour, showed a lot of quality and class. Contributed enormously to this Arsenal performance. He's getting a great reception. Very different when he came off. Just, uh, 
And specific. And throw the gloves down. Good shift. And Joe Willock.